open cafe allows patrons to drink tea and coffee while playing with puppies up for adoption. My name's Haley, I've been working here since January, and we've had three dogs adopted so far, two more that are pending, and we're really careful just to make sure that all dogs uh, go to the perfect forever home, so we have a lot more applications than we actually do adoptions, just because we really make sure to select the right people. He's 15 years old and blind. He, along with many other dogs, have been rescued from nearby shelters. They are the dogs who have been at the shelter the longest and have the highest risk of being euthanized. <laughs> Betsy. And Betsy was in the shelter. She probably would have been euthanized quickly because she was, we could not touch her. She would attack us. Um, her owner took her to a shelter for a doggy abortion and never picked her up. So here she is and she's completely rehabbed. She's friendly. She's like the pack mother and doing yeah. great. <laughs> it's the first door of your crying. Yeah, this is the first dog cafe in the country. Something really awesome for the cafe to, for every, for every place where dogs um, people could meet the dogs that are in the shelters. Um, they have a lot of dogs that have been in the shelter for a long time, so they pull them out and then they try to give them more attention so that they can be up for the option. I think it's something really great that the cafe is trying to do. The Dog Cafe's mission is to revolutionize dog adoption by reinventing the way people connect with rescues who need homes. The Dog Cafe offers a comfortable and fun space for humans and dogs to hang out with each other, away from overcrowded shelters. Advanced reservations are highly recommended. They're open Tuesday to Sunday, and it's a great way to find your new furry friend. I just like seeing how happy people are to see dogs, and also just to see dogs who are abandoned go to homes and, and actually have second lives. But her and Moonshine are very, very good friends. Aww. They're besties forever. I'm Eric Davria Simpson reporting at the Dog Cafe in LA for OC News.